The stadium is buzzing already and with good cause. Two top sides ready to go at it and this should be something special on the pitch. It's Villarreal, they take on Real Madrid and it's coming up next on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a delightful part of Spain. We're here by the Mediterranean at the Estadio de la Ceramica. I'm Derek Ray, ready here on the commentary position. And alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and commentary midfielder, Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Spanish top flight, La Liga. It's Villarreal facing Real Madrid. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And the flag has been raised here. Well, there can't have been a lot of that. Here's Valverde. The ball with Luka Modric. What can Real do from this position? It takes it on! And what a magical save it was! with the corner not away completely and about on to Valverde just looking for the right moment for that final pass Federico Valverde and showing fine vision Modric and just narrowly wide in the end Pedraza Decent position. Can he play it in? Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming. Well, straight into the meat of the penalty area. Just the clearance that was needed. This might be ideal for the counter. Vinicius Junior. Struggle to keep the ball from Real. High pressing at its best. Cocola. Parejo. Cross it in here. And a decent save. Full credit. Intercepting it intelligently. It should be! Oh, keeper dealt with it. David Alaba. This is Kroos. Not a foul, but the advantage with Real Madrid. Modric. Carvajal. Now with Valverde. Villarreal recovering possession well. He's going forward well here. And the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty. 
penalty given. And into the book he goes to. Well, once he gave the penalty, he was always going to give him a yellow card. This to make it 1 0. And he finds the net. No difficulties and counter. Well, when you see it again, the goalkeeper does everything right. Decides which way to go. He chooses the right way, but he actually dives over the top of it and the ball goes underneath him. He's really unlucky. So the action continues. Will there be a quick response from Real? Rudiger. Ada Militao. And Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. And he's made headway. And it goes to square the game. What a contest this is turning out to be. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. Well, he knows this is going to be a tough game now. He's got to get his side playing again here. Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. sequence well that's how to do it inside your own penalty area teammates available now they have possession in a good area of the pitch They'll still be able to do a bit of damage and he's kept it out fully stretched somehow reaching it Bellingham. Modric. A chance to whip it in. Vinicius. Now the comeback. Saved, but still a chance. Just wanted to get it out of there. Can he give them the lead? Oh, a stellar piece of defending. Pedraza. Valverde. Can they forge ahead? They do. And you've got to say they're good value for the lead. Well, just watch this again. It's a really good goal, but it's no surprise, is it? They've been in complete control here. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick.
Let's take another look because this is a great bit of skill. The way he wraps his foot around the ball to bend it into the corner. What a good free kick that is. level again here both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle Federico Valverde Rudiger and so it is the first half has come to an end here at the Estadio della Ceramica Underway then in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. High quality defending. That's a good looking ball. Parejo. Oh, it might be. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlight reel. And the substitution will occur now. Delivering it. And dealt with it nicely. Moreno. The fans want to see a shot. Real chance. Really good piece of goalkeeping there. Neder Militao. Here's Carvajal. Rudiger. Take it away. It's looking promising. of risk there but he's won the ball Vinicius Junior a real opening now and a goal it is to put them in front again no less than they deserve Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, what delight for Ancelotti. That's just what he wanted. Well, the action underway once more. And no shortage of entertainment. 3-2. Etienne Capou, Alexander Surlot. Safe pair of hands, did his job. Carvajal. Really getting stuck in. Now he must favour the cross. This could level it. Oh, but the keeper with an important save. How important is that? Well, he should score from there. That's a wasted opportunity. He should beat the keeper from that sort of distance. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. taken short very quick thinking there G 
Gerard Moreno. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Tony Kors. And a play in a Real Madrid throw-in coming up. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. David Alaba. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. Good movement. Really bright looking attack. Moreno. Oh, good save. Well, just listen to the crowd. They know this is a big chance to equalize. Substitution time as is here. Favoring the short one. Comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. And the pass was just that little bit off. Nearly found its target. players in big chance to get them on terms and that a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again and there's the delivery defending Lucas Vasquez on a poor touch and unable to keep it in play throw in to come and teammates to play it to well we're inside the final quarter of an hour now chance not to be for him he went for power over placement well you're right he decided to go for the power which in the end he couldn't control he'll be furious with himself that's a big miss attack fizzling out well time isn't on their side Villarreal had to score there you feel but what a save from the goalkeeper such a oh hang match. on Stewart it's a chance clears it away Gerard Moreno well it hasn't been a great performance but the fans have been brilliant just listen to the noise. Can the players respond and find this equaliser? Well, play stopped. It is a free kick. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. Played in there. And gobbled up by Courtois. looking promising well, just the tackle that was needed well the fans are driving their team on here but can they respond with a goal time is running out 
Well, still playing here, Real Madrid want to make this a victory. Stuart, interested in your thoughts on their overall performance. Well, what a finale we have here. Both sides have looked good going forward, but poor defensively. But I do think they have been the better side for much of this game. They just need to defend their box with determination in these last few minutes. Now counter-attacking possibilities. Read it superbly to take back possession. And quick thinking defensively. Morales now still pressing for a goal here. And that is that, the end of the game. It goes into the books as a win for Real Madrid. What did you think of their overall performance? Well, they didn't defend as well as they can, but the forward play was excellent today. In particular, I thought the midfield combination of intricate passing and dynamic running was key to their success. They were certainly worthy winners.